Bell's Italian Bakery and Cafe in Virginia Beach, Virginia. Is it big enough? It's huge. It's ridiculous. Mother Gilda and daughter Jessie are the bosses, the cooks, and definitely the heart of this place. Come in here, you're made to feel like you're one of the family. We're more like an Italian home, you know? People come in, we know their first name, we know what they drink, we know what they eat. Stuff meatballs. Stuff meatballs. Yes, sir. Mm. Dude, I'd weigh 5,000 pounds if I lived within 500 miles of this place. All right, what are we going to make? Stuff meatballs. Stuffed with what? Mozzarella. Mo mozzarella? And a lot more than that. More than mozzarella? A lot more. All right, we're making the stuffing. The Make it quick, inside. because I'm going to be outside of what? It's not, not you in a minute. Ah! Really, a stuffed meatball? Yeah. A bunch of cold cuts going to stuffed meatball. Meatball. First step is to dice and slice. Genoa salami, spicy cap. Spicy capicola. Black forest ham. Black forest ham. Provolone. Little provo. And mozzarella. Little mozz, correct? You got it. Oh, there's nothing wrong with that. It's on the low-fat menu. Yeah. Eat this, it'll make you low and fat. <laughs> it's mixed. We're gonna make a meatball first. And then we're gonna put it inside. Work. You've got everything here, except no milk. No milk, I don't do milk. They're not okay. wimpy. We can't have wimpy meatballs. What is it, wimpy? I just had some dental work done. I don't wanna go breaking anything by Trust eating me. these hard meatballs. Trust me, the stuff inside is gonna make it wonderful. You put those on like you're a doctor. Doctor of meatball making. Okay, what do you got? Now I'm putting in a leaner meat mixed together with a fattier meat. 22 eggs. Not 23. 22 is perfect. That's a lot of eggs. I know. We want it a little moist. Because mm -hmm. these breadcrumbs are going to suck up every bit of moisture that these things have. But that's what we want. We want dense meatballs so nothing comes out. You want to do what it? What are these called? The, the desert you know meatballs? <laughs> you know what? We give you the meatballs free here and then it got you have the 20 bucks Let's for a glass of water. Let's say that after you eat it. Dried parsley. Pecorino Romano. Parmigiano Reggiano. Sure. Garlic powder, salt, and pepper. And now I'm mixing. Okay, so now right. bring over the filling. Yep. The scooper duper and a pan that Columbus brought with him on the pinta. Santa Maria. I'm gonna scoop the meatball mixture, place it into my hand, make a hole in it, take a pinch of stuffing, stuff it in, and close it up. I do this, each meatball, one at a time, all day long. All right, so we make these up. Yes. I in the here. oven, 350? Yep. 325. 320. Hey! We burn the meatball at 350. It burns the meatball, puts the lotion on. Low and slow. Now we're gonna do the spaghetti. Don't, don't, it's cold. cold. Don't. It's not gonna be cold it's in a cold. minute. It's, ah, it's ah, cold spaghetti. Not yet. Ah. No. You can't put the cold spaghetti in the. Yes, you can. You know why? Because my grandma's sauce is going on it, and that makes everything all better. Our crushed tomatoes. Okay. We got a little room back there. My grandma sits in there and she makes the tomatoes. It tastes better when my grandma does it with her hands. Okay, so the hot meatballs stuffed with the entire deli selection. Minus what you ate. Oh, nice. All right, two meatballs, spaghetti, nice and fresh, dente, beautiful. Not done yet. Of course we're not done yet. We're gonna have to put more sauce on it. Grandma's gonna be smashing a lot right. of tomatoes. She does all right. Permission to pick up the fork. Absolutely, sir. Look at that. Look at all that creaminess from the provolone and the mozz. Because the inside is so creamy, mm. you do need that hard exterior of that almost to keep it locked in. Yeah. Mm. Not overly flavored. You know, I was wondering with all those cold cuts in there if there was going to be too much salt. A really nice balance. A little sweetness coming out of that ham, a little out of the mozz. Yeah. A little salt from the provolone. Mm. Pasta is al dente. The sauce is sweet and just luscious and great tomato flavor. The fresh basil really sings out. It is dynamite. Here you, Stephanie. Oh, thank you. 